I think you guys know what day of the week it is. It is Furniture Friday. Welcome back, my dudes. It is Mr. Crayfish, and today we are revealing a brand new piece of furniture. And today, this piece of furniture is probably something really awesome, and you guys are going to really love this. This actually integrates into an existing piece of furniture already in the mod. Now, you might have already seen it from the thumbnail and uh, the title of this video today, and today, we're going to be looking at the brand new light switch. Alrighty, so we are going to head over to Craig here and reveal this brand new piece of furniture. Well, it's not really furniture, it's a light switch. Uh, where's my vehicle gone? Where's my vehicle gone? I did have a lawnmower in here, but I think I left it over there. Alright, let's go, let's go ahead and let's take this one here. I'm going to take this one. If you guys haven't seen my latest Vehicle Wednesday video, I added in a working lawnmower. <laughs> this is taking forever to get there though. We're almost there! I can see it! Craig here! Mel I can almost smell it! <laughs> I can almost smell it, my dudes! Ah! The beautiful shop! Craig here! Alrighty! So we're gonna head inside of Craig here, here and they've actually set up a little bit of a display here for us for the new light switch because I want to show you guys straight off the bat how amazing this brand new light switch is and I think you guys are going to absolutely love it and if you guys think that this is awesome make sure you guys remember to go ahead and snap that like button in half show your support for this video and this mod as well because I know you guys love the furniture mod and updates are coming alrighty so let's go ahead let's uh, show off this light switch right now so the whole idea of the light switch is you're going, to, you're going to be able to wirelessly turn ceiling lights on and off. And not only can you turn one off, but you can manage multiple lights as well. So here we go, we've got one set up right here. So this light switch is actually connected to that ceiling light there. And as you can see, there is no kind of visible connections because this is completely wireless. Alrighty, let's go ahead, let's flick this thing on right now in three, two, one. Isn't that just amazing? Isn't that just amazing? And I love the sound that this thing makes, like... <laughs> it actually sounds like a light switch. But as you can see, when we flick it here, the light turns on. And then when we flick it again, it turns off. Now again, you can still do the normal functionality by right clicking the light to actually turn it on and off. So that is still in the game. This is just an extra option in case you're wanting to actually turn it off wirelessly or turn it on. So behind us here, I've actually decided to do something a little bit different. Basically, what we're going to do is lay out all the furniture. And uh, as you can see here, we have the modern window. And above, we're going to have a chest which actually contains the crafting recipe. So to craft the modern window, uh, that has white concrete and a glass pane in the middle here. And the one we're looking at today is the light switch. And to craft this, it is as simple as well. So you simply put a lever in the middle and then surround it with white concrete. So that is how you get the light switch. Now, how do you actually use this? Well, I've tried to make it as simple as possible because um, the furniture mod is supposed to be simple. I never really wanted it to be like a, a tech type mod. So I'm going to show you guys how you can actually utilize this light switch right now. So let's go ahead. Let's actually grab out a light switch here. Uh, we'll go ahead, grab that out there and uh, let's find a spot where we can do this. Maybe not inside a crate here. I don't, I'm not sure if that would like that. Alrighty, let's go over to Crate Industries and uh, let's add some lights in here because I feel like we need some lights, especially for when we actually do reveal vehicles. So we're going to put a light here above the actual um, pedestal here that we have for when revealing vehicles. So we need to go ahead and grab out a ceiling light, which has been in the mod for a very, very long time. And what we're going to do is place that above there. And uh, we might actually place some extras here. Maybe we want this to be really super duper bright. So there we go. We've got some lights on the roof now. And uh, what I want to do is have a light switch right there. Now before we do actually place it down, what we need to do is actually bind these ceiling lights to this light switch. And if we actually go ahead and we hold shift while um, looking at the item here, it will actually tell you what we've got to do. So as you can see, it says here, to connect the switch to the ceiling lights, simply right click the lights with the switch in your hand. 
if you want to remove lights, crouch and right click to clear all. So what that means is basically we can add lights to this light switch simply by right clicking. So let's right click all three of these lights with the same light switch. Now they are currently bound to this light switch. Now if you made a mistake you can actually just simply shift or crouch I should say and right click and that will actually clear it. Now I do want to have some information um, I will have to update it so it has some information on it so you guys can figure out if um, you know a light has been added maybe even rendering over um, these lights here with a, some sort of indicator to know that they're registered but once you've basically right clicked all them simply just place the light switch down and then uh, if we go ahead and right click this now hey there we go so as you can see this is a kind of an example of turning on multiple lights with this brand new light switch so this basically means you can have like a room inside your house with like four of these ceiling lights and uh, you can control them with a single light switch. Something also I want to point out real quickly is that the ceiling lights now emit more light. Previously they were quite dull but now they emit the maximum amount of light that they can. So these are super duper bright now and they're good for uh, stuff like this like my uh, vehicle reveals here. But let's go ahead let's turn this off here and what we're going to do now is we're going to head to my mansion and what we're going to do is actually install these lights throughout my mansion because I want to have lights in every single room. I want to have light switches for every single room. I want to control every single room with uh, the light switches. So let's head back to my mansion and uh, let's, uh, let's get this going. Alrighty, so first of all I want to have some lights out the front here just in case you know, we need to be able to see the people because there's security cameras you know, capturing of people at the front door, but if we can't see their faces, you know, we can't see them. So let's place some lights at the front here, and then what we're going to do is we'll have a light switch like right there. So we'll right click those two, and then we'll place that down, and uh, let's test that out. Yep, it looks like that's working. So very easy to set that up. Let's flick that off, and let's also clear the uh, lights from this light switch. Uh, we need to have some in the kitchen here, so let's grab our ceiling light. Um, let's place it on the roof here, like let's place four like that. Let's add them to the light switch, and then we can put it. Where can we put this? Uh, maybe just there or something. It doesn't really make sense, but hey, there we go. So we've got a uh, light switch for the kitchen now, and some lights. <laughs> I just love flicking it on and off. There's something very satisfying about um, flicking this light switch. I don't know what it is, but it's just uh, it's really fun for some reason. Uh, oh. Who did this? Young Greg? Did you already install this? I don't know what's going on here. Let's go out. <laughs> Let's go to the toilet here. Let's install a uh, light into here. Alrighty, I'm not going to ask questions. I'm not going to ask questions. Why is there a horse in my backyard? I don't know. Uh, let's clear these uh, lights from that and let's uh, bind them to there. Let's uh, put it maybe just down there. There we go, that's working. We've got lights in the bathroom now. Uh, what about my uh, closet over here? Let's go ahead, let's pop lights on top of here. Uh, let's clear that and let's also just right click all these. Pop that down and boom, there we go. Lights for our uh, walk-in wardrobe here. That is so cool, I love that. Look at that. Uh, let's head up to the top here. Oh, this definitely needs some light switches here. This is my gaming setup if you guys don't know. Um, so this one here is over is Young Greg. So we'll have three lights there. But what we're going to do is we're going to have a separate light switch for uh, Young Greg's uh, setup here. So let's right click these three. Let's plop the switch there. So there we go. That's Young Greg's setup. And let's go ahead. Let's uh, put some lights down for mine here. And uh, let's get a light switch for this. Let's clear it. Right click all the lights here. And uh, I'll probably put the light switch maybe there. That would be a good spot. Hey, there we go. So we can now control uh, the ceiling lights separately here with the light switches. This is amazing. This is so cool. 
Let me know what you guys think about these light switches in the comments below. Um, let me know if you're going to be downloading this update because it is available right now. You can go in the description, download this update. So if you do download it, send me some screenshots over on my Twitter. Link in the description below. Go chuck me a follow uh, because I do post a lot of sneak peeks before I actually create videos on them. So um, I did actually kind of sneak peek this on my channel, uh, on my Twitter, sorry. But that, my dudes, is going to end off this week's Furniture Friday. Make sure you stay tuned till next week where we reveal a brand new piece of furniture uh, for the Furniture Mod. I, I love these kind of weekly updates. Let me know if you guys love these kind of weekly updates to all my mods because the Furniture Mod is getting the modern update, if you guys don't know, the modern update. So that's why we have a light switch because it's kind of modern. But if you haven't already, make sure you guys go ahead and snap that like button, subscribe so you can keep up to date with all my latest videos. And and I'll catch you guys later uh, for some more epic videos. Peace out, my dudes.